Hi, my name is Lance Drucker, president of Drucker Wealth Management with a 30-second thought of the day. In the last few weeks, I've been fortunate to hear some incredible speakers at various events that I've gone to, but one in particular stands out, and his name is Lieutenant Robert O'Neill. He's a, a Navy SEAL lieutenant retired, and he wasn't just a SEAL, he was actually in SEAL Team 6. He was involved in the rescue of Captain Phillips, you know, the Tom Hanks movie. He was also involved in uh, Osama bin Laden, uh, the, the taking out of. He was there in both situations. So an amazing warrior, an amazing American hero. But he said two things which really resonated with me, uh, again, as a person and, and as an owner of a firm and as a wealth manager. He said the first thing, what he found, was your first reaction is almost always wrong. You know, I guess his point was in a firefight, you hear the shooting going and, you know, you want to turn and, and duck, whereas, you know, SEALs are trained, you attack the problem. And many of us, when we hear about the market just fell or China or oil or whatever the crisis is, our first reaction is, you know, we should sell, we should get out. Almost always the worst, react, the worst choice. And secondly, and this was really interesting, he said no one has ever experienced anything positive during panic. He said, if you feel like you're drowning, if you're under fire, and, and you know, he went on to elaborate about it, but it, come, it also comes back when occasionally, thankfully very occasionally, I get calls from clients who are anxious, they're nervous, and when they get in panic mode, it's sell everything and move to cash. Hardly ever in history has that ever been the right move, unless you knew when to get back in, and the chances of that, of that happening are infinitesimally small. So his third point was, always have a plan. And you can do the plan in pencil, and you can always change the plan. But as long as you don't react, you don't panic, and you're working off of a plan, usually the outcome is more positive than you might imagine. So thank you, Lieutenant O'Neill, for your service, and uh, thank you for those words of wisdom. Thanks. Have a great day.